um, my organization is a member of NCRC, and we're um, you know we think that the agenda is an important one. We um, my organization was involved way back when in the struggles to establish CRA, and uh, uh, I think NCRC has built on those struggles and developed into an organization that's doing a lot of things. But that's still. Um, an important part of, of why we're here. Uh, I'm here now also in DC because I'm really, really concerned about the budget situation and I'm right. concerned about the um, compromise that has been reached. And uh, you know, I'm going to have a chance to um, have some Hill visits and meet with our delegation from Maine and talk to them about those concerns and see if there's any. We'll go room on some of the issues and some of the things that have been cut that are really important. You uh, mentioned like housing counseling, for instance. Right. Um, Diane runs our housing counseling program. Um, Not for long, apparently. Well, <laughs> hang in there, hang in there. No, uh, I mean, we're, we're very upset that uh, that particular item got the axe in the, uh, in the continuing resolution. And we're worried about the future, obviously, for that, considering the <coughs> level of foreclosures that we're seeing and then the amount of counseling we do, which is like, what, 600 people a year now? No, 800, 900. Oh, yeah, right. We're already higher ed, right. Or something now. Right. Two quarters. Yeah. yeah. I wasn't thinking about that who's on my own. Yeah, so that's one big issue. Right. And so, and Maine is a very small state. Right. And we, organizations in Maine tend to have pretty strong relationships with um, the delegation and their staff. So I would say that they are always receptive, both the Dems and the Republicans, always listen um, and will often try to do what they can. I, I'm concerned now because you know, our two moderate Republican senators, they may not have the same leverage that they did a couple of years ago. Sure. And, of course, our two Democratic reps are now in the minority. So, right. it, not that all of these issues are partisan issues, but, but they, they, don't, they don't have the same power that they uh, might have had just a couple of years ago. Uh, that may or may not be true for the Senate. Just a different, different political